Unexplored Fields is a collective of 3D artists both passioned by fashion, CGI, and fine arts. Our main focus is art directing and producing digital fashion campaigns for fashion brands like Lacoste, Dr. Martens, Calvin Klein. It goes from doing 3D pack shots to motion design and short films. Working with fashion items obviously leads to do cloth simulation a lot, but the field of fashion is wide and connects with many skills such as environment building, sound design, and avatar creation. The digital humans we create have to embody the spirit of the brand and follow the guidelines of the brand's art directors while being able to follow short calendar. Implementing character creator in our pipeline allowed us to work more efficiently with realistic avatar creation as modifications are relatively quick to do. For our project prototype, we wanted to show a character wearing a digital prototype we designed internally. Here's how we proceed. For this exercise, we selected a scan that we liked from VFace library by XYZ Texturing. The high poly model was generated in Blender before being imported in Character Creator 4. The high poly model will be projected on a Character Creator base mesh. Character Creator 4 recently added the Headshot 2 feature, which allows to generate a model based on a 3D scan. For this to happen correctly, we have to carefully place some points of references on the head, then after a bit of polishing, we generate a full body with the scanned face. To get to the final animation, we connected an iPhone 12 Pro to the Live Face plugin to record some facial animation. Combined with the iClone 8 Motion Plus animations, it worked great. We also activated the wrinkles deformations as we wanted some extreme close-ups on the face. After the avatar was done, we could start modeling and simulation the cloth and accessories. The main was simulated in Clo 3D, while the earrings, the bag and the shoes were handled in Blender and Houdini. We used Blender to assemble all the elements, and Character Creator makes it pretty easy with the CC Blender Tools add-on, as it allows to automatically have access to all the textures, but gives us full control of the rig and blend shapes of the avatar. That's cool. This was the behind the scene of the fashion film prototype. Thanks for watching.